What's good everyone? My name is Josh High Tech and in this video, I'm talking about the Stack Overflow Developer Survey. It had over 90,000 developers input and I wanna see what they were talking about. So let's get straight into it. All right, so we are on the website for the Stack Overflow Developer Survey for 2023. Um, so like I said, it came in May 2023, over 90,000 developer responded to their annual survey. So let's check it out. It says most developers have a post-secondary education having some college or more so 84 percent and as you can see right here um the highest percentage is somebody having a bachelor's degree which is what i have as well i have a bachelor's degree it's not in computer science but i do have a bachelor's degree so i'm in that category um i see master's degree is second you know, people get that second degree to make sure that they're good when it comes to being a developer. Um, that says a lot, man, that says a lot. The next one, learning to code. So this one is showing you uh, how many ways that people learn to code. So as you can see, the vast majority, overwhelmingly is online resources. So that means videos, blogs, forums, as you see, 80%, 80% you all, that is a big percentage. So I guess that's why you know, it's the, it's the majority as well as, as you can see is books, physical media, schooling, which is 50%. And it's pretty interesting, like, you know, but it's pretty understandable. And it said 87,000 people, uh, did this one and yeah. And if you could look at it, we could go by age and you see by 18 year old, majority of them online resources and it dips a little bit when you get to 18 and 24. But as you can see too, schooling, that makes sense once you're 18 to 24. And then 25 to 34, you know, on the job training. You see how much that one has increased? Like on the job training has increased. But that's because, you know, for 20, 25 to 34, you're usually working as a developer at that point. So you are gaining a lot of experience. Um, and it's saying like, you know, the older generation, as you continue on, you know, books and physical media is the thing for the older generation. Now this may change, you know, as, uh, the generations that 25 and up as they get older or really 18 up as they get older and get to that 65 age in the next like 30, 40 years, like this may definitely change or books and physical media may not be the thing. And it's really going to be like online resources it's just the way that the world is changing so much technology is improving a whole lot so and that's the preferred method for a lot of people so i can see it definitely shifting uh, within the next 30 years so the online resources that people learn how to code you got the technical documentation stack overflow blogs how-to videos written tutorials so that's pretty interesting. 70,000 people responded. So the technical documentation, that is always the way. So like, this is why this uh, survey is very important because it really shows you like what are the most popular ways that people learn and be effective as developers. And as you can see, reading documentation is very, very important. If you're a developer, like if you're not good at it, start getting good at it because it's really going to put you in a position to succeed. Um, as well as, you know, Stack Overflow is right there. So you need to know how to read and understand and how to word certain questions so you can get your answer or get closer to the answer. So those are very important things too, as well as blogs. If you're not using Medium, you know, Twitter, uh, you need to see these blogs and actually like really understand uh, this written content because we have to read as well. Even though it might be a physical book, it's also online with these blogs and that's very important. So this is really good as well as for me, but also for you all as devs to see exactly like what this market is saying with regards to 70,000 people, um, which is a lot of people. So years of coding, 48% of respondents have been coding for less than 10 years, almost half uh, less than 10 years. And this is 87,000 people. So the vast majority of uh, the survey. And it says that, you know, yeah, a big percentage of them, um, less than 10 years. And I'm in that category as well, less than 10 years. And, um, I'm looking forward to getting past 10 years, you know, but you know, I'm, uh, 
this is just very interesting to see it. Um, an average of our top 10 countries. You got Australia. Yeah, they eat cold for a long time. You got United States of America, you know, 16, Canada. So it's all not too far um, of a drop, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, so now let's get into technologies. And unless you know, I'm not going to get through everything. Just as like doing a quick overview of what I've seen and showing you all. So this is the most popular technologies. So JavaScript is number one. HTML, CSS, number two, Python. It's pretty interesting. Like that JavaScript is doing this well. Not a surprise, but interesting. In learning to code, HTML, CSS is always, you know, usually very important in the beginning. And then you go right into JavaScript and Python. Very, very important as well. And oh, that's interesting right here. Work environment. You have 41% remote, 42% hybrid, 16% in person. As you can see, it's a battle between hybrid and remote work. Um, so that's really good. And then the company size. This is interesting as well. 10% getting that 10,000 employees or more Then you have the bulk is within 220 employees to 500. All right. So this concludes the Stack Overflow developer survey. If you want to see more videos, be sure to subscribe and leave a comment below and I'll see you all in the next video.